So we left off um, talking about kinetics and rate laws. And we introduced this idea of the rate law and what rates are. And that was all last week's material. And we have moved on from there to discussing the rate constant and the order of the reaction. And why it was important was the f that the order has a direct effect on the rate of the reaction. And this manifests itself in the relationship between the concentration and the rate. And the way we did this was looking at the initial rate method. In the initial rate method, we vary one of the concentrations and we measure the effect on the rate. So it's concentration versus rate data, those two pieces of information. Now, one of the things we're going to talk about today is pseudo first order conditions. We're going to introduce the concept of pseudo first order conditions and as a quick and dirty way of getting at rate information. We're not going to do too much with it, but we're going to talk about it because it's very important in chemical reactions. And then we're going to talk about graphical, graphical methods for um, figuring out rate laws. And that's where we're going to spend the, the rest of this mini lecture.